Hello everybody, uh, we're actually in Western Australia, we're in Perth, we're at Scarborough Beach and we're chatting with Tess Woods, the very lovely Tess Woods. Now Tess is a writer, she's a first time writer, she was actually, well during the day I guess, um, she's a physiotherapist and at night you would say that she's a writer or the other way around, <laughs> but either way she's written a fabulous book, do you want to hold your book up and show us Tess, Love at First Flight. Now, Tess has a really interesting story about how she got published, about the writing process. So for all you aspiring writers, tune in right now. And for those of you that just want to know a good story or hear about a good story, uh, Tess is going to talk to us about Love at First Flight. Uh, now, Tess, tell us, what is your book about? Okay, my book is about a lady called Mel. She is a doctor who lives in Perth and it's actually, the book is set right here at the Rendezvous Hotel. Um, and she seems to have the kind of life that people would think of as having it all. She's got a great husband, she has a great career, beautiful family, they're quite well off. And um, she boards a flight to go to Melbourne just to meet up with a girlfriend and sitting next to her on the plane is a younger man from Melbourne called Matt and by the end of that flight Mel's life has started to unravel because she's um yeah she sat on the flight and just realized that there's something really critical missing from her life and it's the kind of passion that she's after so the book looks at uh, I guess how people self-destruct when they seem to have everything going for them. And, and then they make some, make some bad decisions, yes, I guess. Yes, make really bad decisions. And just it's really about just what, watching the process of a marriage in destruction and just the ramifications of an affair and what happens afterwards. And, yeah, it's quite dark, quite confronting, but, yeah. For those of you that have just joined us, we're talking to Tess Woods. We're actually in Western Australia, Scarborough Beach, at the Rendezvous Hotel, and we're actually on level 25. And as you can see, I'm just going to do a panoramic view. Tess, I hope you don't mind, but I just want to show all our readers yeah. where we are. This How is so, it is. it is so beautiful. Uh, now, I'm from Sydney, and I always, I notice when I come to Western Australia, yeah. the, the light here is so different. Do you find that? Absolutely. And I actually think our, it sounds really strange, but I think our sky is bigger. I always come it home and think way. our sky is so huge yeah, yeah. and so blue. Yeah. And our water is so blue. Yeah. It really feels that way. Yes. Okay, now hold up your book again. Uh, it's called Love at First Flight, and, we'll, and it's Cheryl Arkler, and I'm talking to Tess Woods in Perth. Now, tell me a little bit about how this, you know, had you always wanted to write a book? How did the idea come to you? How did you actually embark on writing a book? And then yeah. how did you get published? Okay, I had no, I had absolutely no intentions of writing a book. I was quite busy and settled. Um, as a physiotherapist, my husband and I run two clinics here. At the time it was three, um, and I had two small children, but I actually got obsessed with Twilight. Uh, as embarrassing as that is to say live, I read all four Twilight books in a week, and I kind of read them because they, there was all that hype about the movie that was out at the time. So once I read the four books, I went to see the movie, and it was actually the next day after I had seen the Twilight movie that a scene just from nowhere just came to me and it was extremely strong, just a very visual thing that I could really imagine. And I felt compelled to go and write it down. So I wrote down that scene and from there I just couldn't stop writing. And that scene kind of fell in the middle of the book. So I wrote that scene and then I was like, oh, okay, what has to lead up to that scene? So I sat and wrote, and I had about 45,000, 50,000 words after three days, so the book just poured out of me. I had no idea what was happening, it wasn't plotted, so the whole thing just sort of came out. And um, yeah, seven years later, <laughs> I got a book. So this is there's two stories in Tess Woods, I think. There's Tess's story, um, her fabulous debut fiction novel called Love at First Flight. Um, and do yourself a favour and read it. It's a great mm -hmm. book if you haven't read it already. But there's also the story about following your dream, about being tenacious. Mm -hmm. You know, it's not easy to write. People no. often think that, you know, it's... I find that putting pen to paper is a real craft. It's a job, it's an occupation, yes, it's absolutely. a dedication. It's something that you need to learn. Yes. 
Um, and it took you a long while to get there and you learned a lot yeah. in the process. You absolutely. learned how to write, didn't oh, you? Yes, absolutely. And I think just writing those initial you know, 50,000 words, I would have got nowhere. If I had have left it at that and then just tried to pitch it to publishers, they just would have laughed me out of town. And um, I had to learn. Because I hadn't studied writing or done anything with craft, I really just worked very hard for several years um, with mentors and uh, yeah, manuscript assessors. And then once I had pitched and found a literary agent, her and I went back and forth together. And it was just And a wrote very, and rewrote, didn't Yes, it? yes. Yeah. It's 11 rewrites to get to where I am now. That's so, fantastic. Yeah. And to get to where you are and to be published by HarperCollins and to have yeah. written a fabulous book that people want to read. And it's won awards, hasn't it? What awards? Yeah, it so, well, it's won one. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's great. <laughs> one is good. It's won the um, Osram Today Reader's Choice Awards for Book of the Year for 2015 in December last year, which is very, very exciting. Well, we've been chatting with Tess Woods, uh, the author of Love at First Flight. Have you got that book there in front of you to show us? There we go. Here's her fabulous book. We're at Scarborough Beach, and I'll just give you another panoramic view of where we are. Absolutely divine day here in Perth, in Western Australia. Thank you so much, Tess Woods, for speaking with us. Thank you, Cheryl. Our readers, our better reading readers, love recommendations. They love meeting the author, and they love to learn about the writing process. Oh. So you've um, you've covered all that for them. Well, thank you, and I just want to thank your better reading audience as well, because I've had so much support from your site, and people have messaged me and found me on Facebook, and they found me through you. So. Thank you, Better Reading. It's just been fantastic, the promotion you've given me, and thank you to your wonderful readers. Okay, then.